We're gonna have Mustafleet versus Vitality on stream. All right, so bringing the, bring the Akuma back, introducing a jury. Introducing a jury. Yep, Cincinnati's own Ultimate Vitality. Well, the last jury of Ohio since somebody decided to stop playing the character. The I might go back. Jury. I no longer have like the bad, like. <laughs> I no longer have bad muscle memory with her since I have no muscle memory anymore. <laughs> but yeah, one of my favorite players in Ohio, for sure. So we'll see. We'll see what happens here. What? Now, traditionally, I think Mustafli's has edged out on Vitality, but it's usually always a really close match. So it should be a good show. This is, this is one of the ones I'd be... If I looked at this bracket, this is one of the ones I'd say I'm the most excited for. Sure. On the other side of winners, we'll have the winner of Iron Zangief and Sebman versus Dante, who's waiting for them. I'm actually curious what's going to be going on with Sebman versus Iron Zangief. Gonna Probably be... a Geef Mirror, honestly, because that's what Seth Man likes to do. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Round one. Fight. I, got many, I think we got like we got one Geef Mirror out of Shancha versus Zangief, I think, once. But Did they play? I think so. I know we've seen a Geef Mirror and the Alpha's in it. Hmm. Wait, anyway, let's not talk about that match, let's talk about this one. Yeah, so uh, Vitality is really just going to try and stay right outside of uh, Akuma's range. Um, they have pretty similar walk speed, so I think Akuma's is a little bit better. But Jury's stand medium kick, uh, I think, outclips a lot of what Akuma's trying to do, except maybe his. Except maybe Akuma's crouching heavy punch. Uh, that might be the big gotcha that Vitality has to look out for. Um, but outside of that, now the uh, game begins. Yeah, this is actually going to be like a very... Oh, oh no. no. Drop. You trigger one jury as an anime character. <laughs> oh, very precarious who landed and blocked the fireball. Okay. And That's clipped by the overhead. Mark. Very like sad. He doesn't get tilted from that situation. He brought a lot of damage back. Yeah, I mean, that's what Akuma does. As soon as he activates the trigger, you get clipped once, you're eating 300 into OP. I was Man. talking about the jury conversion, but that's also oh, true. Yeah. <laughs> able to Very come nice OP. DPs. Ooh, another drop, that's unfortunate, but I don't think Mustafli knows the punish, the correct punish for that since he went for the throw. Yeah. Oh! Opting the try pinwheel. Goes for the activation. Dead. Yeah. That move is dangerous to go for. <laughs> oh, no conversion drop. into uh. DP. Is it a DP? I think, he, I, think he, I think that only works with the EXDP and he didn't have the meter for it. That might be it. Oh, oh gets clipped! And away he goes. Instant air, two hitting fireball that leads into a full combo into super. Couldn't be me. Good. Kuma <laughs> Couldn't Kuma be good. me. <laughs> People thought this character dropped it here. People are insane. <laughs> But the thing is, I think, I, I don't know if this is true in DT1, but normally if you block an instant air, air fireball, uh, the Akuma's gonna be minus when he falls to the ground. But with DT1 air fireball being two hits, it, the frame data might be different. Oh my goodness. Oh god. Charging right up in this man's face. DP gets clipped. This is... Atrocious, what we're seeing. Back fierce the entire into the quarter. Vitality slowly bringing it back with Feng Shui conversions. 
slowly pushing Mistopolis to the opposite end of the screen. Opting to go for the charge. Nice use of it right then and there. Let the anime begin. <laughs> Good pick, Rab. Yep. Good job on Vitality for keeping his composure. Round two. The ultimate Vitality recovering all that ground he lost in the first game. Good damage. The scary thing about Akuma is because of how fast his walk speed is and how easy it is to get clipped by staying medium kick, it's real easy to get yourself walked into the corner. And then from there he gets to just bully you. Oh, oh no. my god! Anti-aired and then blown up. <laughs> blown sky high. Alright, so Vitaly responds with a pressure sequence into VT activate. Alright, back throw from Mistopheles. Jury has the damage to bring this back. He's gonna have to find a way to get it in. That was a brave fireball throw. Considering yeah, Mistopheles knows uh, Vitaly had V skill ready. Yeah, yeah V skill one charges up, but. I tell you, just not ready to respond. Good whip on this fire, Mistopheles. Back throw to keep him in the corner. Or forward throw. Go forward, DX kicks. Grabbed out of the overhead, very nice. I feel like Mustafa didn't need to do an overhead there, though it could be wrong. That just seems like not spot to do an overhead. He trigger oh, one. Oh. Oh. To jump really into funny. block. Very nice on the side of Mr. Mustafa or uh, Ultimate Vitality. Now, contrary to what the life bars might Ooh. say, it was a, that it, that game state right there was actually even. Jury win. But Vitality managed to clip uh, Mustafa's toes and seal it. Indeed. One to one. One to one. If Vitality can keep his composure and if no more unlucky drops, which I think I saw like five of them in the past two games, which were all situations where they seemed like they should have worked. Uh, I think Vitality has a good shot taking this, but he's just got to keep his composure. Yeah, both of these two are very fundamentally uh, solid players. It's just a matter of like which one of them can retain their, their patience more so than the other. Keep right. up the composure, keep out that medium kick. How far? Able to get a pretty good life lead off of Decent amount of pokes, EX pinwheel neck. Yeah, it does. <laughs> wow, and the trade with a fireball kept Mustafis from getting an additional conversion. I don't think that was intentional, but that's some tech that if I were Vitality, I'd review and see how I could use that later on. Alright. Alright. Oh, oh, bust out with the EXDP. EXDP. He wanted that round really bad. Round two. Point trigger in my face. <laughs> That was a mistake. Yes, Henry. EP, good damage. Hey, hey. Crossover into the side switch, that's what you want. But again, Akuma's walk speed and buns are so oppressive that um, Masopoli's had no issue getting back into neutral. Hey, hey. Oh, that's a Ooh, missed the hit from there. That could have sealed it, though I think that was only one hit. That should be it. Yep. Oh. Well, on the last round, the last game, Final to determine round. who's going to ascend to winner's finals. Everything's even but the bar. I think, I think that's minus enough that Mustafa's could have done a real punish. Possibly. Get the sweep. Vitality's in trouble. I'll 
opting for a much more distanced game plan. Masafli's almost feeling like he's playing the keep out. Yeah, I mean, that's what you want to do when you're um, in the lead. You want to give your opponent every opportunity to fail. Ooh, missed the hit from there. That could have been huge. Now for Vitality. Ooh, trying to play things. Injured. Another missed hit confirmed. A couple of really... Like loose Steven. pokes. A little nervous. Yeah, not canceling the second hit of medium kick. And the soft is just slowly building up V gauge. Get the projector on the ground. Oh, and that's gonna do yeah, it. I don't I don't I don't think I agree with that V trigger activation because that's that you have to get him chipped out off of any light hit. Mm. Um, but it didn't matter anyways because he got clipped. The Mr. Mostopoli is taking it.